The 10th of December is one of the most important dates in the human rights calendar. For it was on this day, in 1948, that the United Nations General Assembly adopted the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. Each year, that day is commemorated as Human Rights Day. During the past year, individuals, families and communities around the world have faced challenges like never before. The COVID-19 pandemic has upended lives, plunging millions of people here in the Asia-Pacific into situations of extreme vulnerability. In the midst of this, national human rights institutions have worked tirelessly to keep their communities safe, inclusive and cohesive. They have called for human rights to be respected in planning and implementing public health strategies. They have monitored access to health services and they have stood resolutely against the voices of fear and prejudice. APF members have also been courageous advocates for the rule of law in situations where their government has declared a state of emergency or instituted hard lockdowns. This independent scrutiny is crucial to ensure that governments use these powers carefully and for the good of the community, consistent with international human rights standards. Throughout 2020, the APF has played a vital role to provide advice and support to our members, to foster collaboration and exchange, and to stand together in the most difficult of times. Human Rights Day is an opportunity to recognise what we have achieved through solidarity, through resilience, and through a steadfast commitment to upholding human rights. We know the challenges presented by COVID-19 will be with us for the year ahead. And we will draw on the lessons of 2020 to continue advocating for human rights to be at the centre of national, regional and international responses. We will continue advocating for fairness, inclusion and above all, dignity.